What up gamers, Fens here here, and welcome back to Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. So uh, last time we met up with uh, Chundor, you know, with Zalbar, you know, that's, uh, yeah, Chundor is Zalbar's uh, brother, as we headed to this planet, um, Kashyyyk. And now, uh, yeah, we need to do a favor for him to kill another Mad Claw that is like Zalbar. Uh, let's go ahead and fight these guys. Um, yeah, we'll do some advanced lightsaber throws. Oh, the purple lightsaber. Ooh, yeah. Actually, yeah, can I fight this guy instead? There we go. Nice, yeah, we just dealt with that really fast. Um, yeah, we're gonna have you healed up to the max. But dude, look at those purple yeah. lightsabers, man. Oh, it just feels so good to have. Because, yeah, like, I think they look really cool. You know, we're going Mace Windu on these guys. Also Ahsoka, in a way, because we got the, the longer lightsaber and the shorter lightsaber. Uh, that must be the guy that we can talk to to go to the Shadowlands. Okay. <laughs> I guess, um... The word like the word got out pretty fast. All right. All right. Don't worry if it's anything like uh whoa. Oh, it's more of those flying things. Okay. Let's go. Yeah, behind you this whole time, you didn't notice this. Like, you didn't notice these guys. Okay, cool. <laughs> yeah, behind you this whole time, like, yeah, they are just... They're just standing there. Here. Yes. There we go. Alright. Come on, guys. We gotta go and, uh... You know, do the stuff with Zalbar and all that. Uh, ooh, let's go and make a checkpoint. Haven't made one yet. Checkpoint. Okay. Let us uh, go now. Um, advanced lightsaber throw. Maybe for a couple of times and then... Okay, you're down. Let's go for you next. You cannot win. There we go. Nice. And so uh, we just keep on going over here. Oh my. Okay. Got some guys over there. You know what I just realized that the cure on Bastila is that the same thing that it, like happens in the sequels, you know, like in the, the Star Wars sequels. Is that is that essentially the same thing? I don't know. Um. Oh boy, can't do lightsaber throws. <laughs> Got you guys. I like how the Wookiees use the, the vibro blades. I'm just passing through. Um, yeah, I mean, yeah, I don't mean any harm. Um, yeah, I mean, you know, I am Fencer Ebenwolf and I act for Chundar. Is this the Mad Claw? I have no idea. Um, yeah, explain what you meant by that. I mean, 
Yeah, just a few questions. I'm a friend. <laughs> oh man, yeah, I really need to, need to put some points to Charisma, but, you know, I want to be the best fighter too. Okay. Well, I guess uh, I'll be going now. I'm not sure where your Wookiee friends went to. Um, here we go here. Is the elevator nearby? Is that him over there? There's a cylinder that we can interact with. Oh yeah, this looks like an elevator, right? A bowcaster and combat suit. Yeah, there's a Gorwukan. Okay, guess we can go down now. Um, in case there's like an encounter, like right away as we <laughs> descend. Just unlock the thing and lower me down. And boy, be still. I mean, what can go up uh, like on us? Those flying things? Oh, here we go. Movie. Oh boy. The forest floors. Oh boy, here we go. What is that over there? Uh, oh my gosh, dude. I want your blades. I want the... Like, uh, those are different, right? They just look bigger than... And also different from the normal. Oh my gosh. Well, hold on, what is that thing? That thing is... That thing looks scary, the way it walks around. Oh, it's a talk! Hey, I need you. I need your glands. Come back here. Oh no. Oh boy. Let's make this quick. See, these are the Katarns. And now we can level up. Let's go in, uh, skills, uh, yeah, <laughs> treat injury. Okay, yep, I mean that's recommended as always, right? And my powers, ooh. I am not level 18, right, so I can't do this still. Uh, what else can I do? That's also level 18. What are some... Other dark side. There's the force push, force suppression. Um, uh, didn't buy that. I actually don't even understand. Cancer first and second tier. Yeah, I don't. I don't know what that means. <laughs> Light side power, universal. Where's the dark sides? Is it really not a lot? There's also the wound. Cause great pain. Okay. Slow and fear. I don't know. I mean, I don't really like them. I like the uh, the lightnings and all that. Oh man. And look, here's the cure. <laughs> you know what? Maybe we can get the burst of speed. Or you know what? Hold on. What's another one? Force resistance. Energy. I mean, do we have to activate these things first when we do these? Oh, hold on. This is the Jedi mind trick, right? Effect mine. Oh. Hold on. This might be a waste of a perk, but I want that Jedi mind trick. I think that's what it is. I could be wrong, but yeah. Sorry, dude. I, I need your glands. Okay. Can I not have your glands? 
I guess I can't. I don't know what's happening. It looks like he wants me to follow him. Ooh, who's that? Who's that? Who's that? I see a lightsaber. I must go in. He has a green lightsaber. Yo, this guy. Ah, the damnable racket of battle. Watch yourself. Even more of these crawling beasts are hiding in the underbrush. Uh, who are you? And what are you do? What are you doing here? Or uh, what? Do I have to fight you as well now? I'm Jolie. Jolie Bindo. Follow me to my camp, and we'll talk a bit. Um, you use a lightsaber in battle. Are you a Jedi? Ah, don't start fawning just yet. I'm too old for it. Uh, I, I know a few things, but we can talk about it. Keep close. It's nearby, under a log. Yeah, I live like some burrowing rodent. I fought the Sith. Now look at me. <laughs> okay, this guy is kind of interesting, but... Yeah, where's this tech? I can hear him. Oh, there's more. So yeah, what am I supposed to do? How am I supposed to... Supposed to get it? Yeah, attack Galan. I don't know, man. I'm guessing I gotta find some dead tacks around here, or some rubble. Oh! Volcatarn. Concussion grenade? Okay, let's go and leave now. Go follow the man with the lightsaber. Because, yeah, it's always nice to have some people with lightsabers around. Hey, dude. Jolie. Well, welcome to my home, such as it is. Pull up a stump and be comfortable. We should discuss <laughs> Pull up a stump. How am I supposed to do that? Or, like, boots it to the ground. Um, I mean... Yeah, uh... Yes, I feel like there is much you can tell me as a... You know, it looks like you're a Jedi, so yeah. Don't cut me, child. I'm neither a Jedi nor your master. I'm just an old man that's... Yo, these tax mander, the <laughs> screaming. My days of glory are behind me. But perhaps there is something I can do for you. You must have questions. Yeah. Um. You know, I want to ask about you. Uh. What is there to tell? Jolie Bindo is the crazy old man in the dangerous place. I'm content with the impression I give. But you use a lightsaber in battle. You are a Jedi. I follow the Jedi way, and I command the Force. Yes. I suppose that makes me as much a Jedi as anyone, but what of it? Why should being what I am compel me to entertain others with tales of the good old days? Ah, I've seen my share of the dark and the light. Frankly, both extremes annoy me. Of course, I have felt rumblings of change. Kinda nice to meet a Jedi who isn't all hung up on this light side, dark side stuff. It gets pretty tiring, you know? Perhaps you <laughs> will be of some assistance to me after all. Let us discuss what we came here for. Um. Yeah, I want to ask you some questions. Fine, fine, just be brief. Yeah, um, have you any knowledge of the star maps? Well, why would you be asking about that, hmm? Did you know that? I knew that had to be why you were here. The problems of a few days don't amount to anything before the concerns of the Jedi. No, you are here for the map. I mean, yeah, if you have information, please tell me. Kashyyyk is an interesting place. More so than anyone suspects. If Circa Corporation knew, the planet would be a strip mine. Oh. The Wookiees have their legends that they were not always here. But it is more than that. The trees themselves are strangers. Oh. I mean, I, I don't understand. Can you be more specific about this? What I'm saying is that there are literally walls in your way. And you won't find what you need without my help. My help has a price. You must do a task, and then allow me to join with you. I will then remove certain barriers in your path. Um, yeah. I'm honored to help someone of your experience. Oh, say it. <laughs> I know this sounds absurd, but I'm old and entitled to work you around a bit. Besides, the test is simple. Since they began expanding in the Shadowlands, the Serpent have left me alone for the most part. Until recently, anyway. A group of them set up camp not far from here. 
poachers is all they are. I have them removed from this place. Yeah. Yeah. Um, where are they and how many men? They are not that far northeast of here. There's usually five in the area, as far as I can see. The captain of the yard is the one that earned my hire. Mishandle my garden, Willie. <laughs> Uh, why do you want to join up with me? You presumably have a ship. I've seen all I wish to here. Isn't that enough? I mean, oh. I'm sick of the trees. And perhaps your destiny might show me something new. You never know. My destiny? Um, <laughs> yeah, um, I mean, I imagine he just needs help. I'm, I'm not going to answer this. I will look into it. Good. Return to me here and we'll see how you have done. Shoot! Shoot! Wait, is this guy going to be a companion? Wow, we get another Jedi companion. Okay. Yeah, I want to get... <laughs> I don't want to be near these uh, monkeys anymore. Um, yeah, I guess I'll just explore around. I don't even know where to go for this. Um, yeah. Let's see. Oh, northeast of this camp. Okay. So I'm guessing we go here then. Oh, another bull. Okay. Yeah, let me go and save before we engage in combat. But yeah, is that going to be a, like my... Like another companion I can have? I'm guessing so. The force fights with me. There, take that. Hold on. All right, keep on going with the fights. Oop. Basilo's down. Yeah, she needs to heal up before we move on. Well, yeah, I'm guessing Jolie's gonna be the next companion that we obtain for ourselves. There we go. Yeah, you need a lot of cure. <laughs> uh, you need a lot of cure. Almost there. One more. Oh, come on, one more. There sure. we go. All right. What is what is that? <laughs> what is this thing? It just stood out to me when I saw it. Dude, these these tax man. Oh, they're they're right there. Hey, do you have? Is there a dead body of one of you guys could, that I can maybe harvest, please? Why is there like a single single vine here? <laughs> oh man. And yeah, speaking of vines, you know, I'm kind of reminded of like Indiana Jones and. You know, the whole swinging and all that with his whip. Um, yeah, dude, just imagine that with uh, Bastila here. I guess we're going south over here. No. There's a droid. A broken droid. You can investigate that. Malfunction. Oh. My primary motivators are in this book. Hello. Damage terminal. Playback calls you, Malfunction. Playback. I get it. That merchant said there was salvage down here. We need Matten to work the sensors. Playback. When he gets back, we'll... Wait, I'm getting something. Oh good, it's Eli. Maybe he'll point us in the right direction. Playback. Eli, what are you... You got your money, you double-crossing snake. We had a deal. Oh, no. Um... Yeah, I'll scrap you in. Take what I can. Shutting down. Primary system. Yeah, start with the droid's head. Okay. Oh my gosh! <laughs> it just... That was a big explosion. Okay, well, yeah. Uh, definitely, um... You know, the other guy would want to hear about this. Eli is not a good person. But yeah, the way to... Yeah, deal with the, uh... These guys we gotta deal with is over here instead, I think. Um, let's go in... Make a checkpoint. But yeah, um, Eli just... <laughs> he just killed him, man. Wow. go. Alright, good job, good job, guys. 
Dude, I don't like these attacks, man. They're just so loud. They're so, so loud. Like, you know, it's like constantly loud. That's what I don't like. Oh no, corpse. Uh, a slaver contract. Journal entry, what? Uh, Wookiee lost. You have found a Wookiee called Roar War in a Shadowlands. A data pad revealing that he dealt with slavers was on the body, as well as a bull, bull caster bolt casting that probably belongs to whoever killed him. And then, yeah, we got that thing. Um, yeah. Okay. Well, let's go. Yep. Tack? Is there any dead tacks over here, please? Yes. That's what I'm looking for. Also, cure. Go and cure everyone here. That must be it. That must be it. Okay. Oh no. Hold on. Uh. Good thing we got mission here. Hey, can you recover the mines? There we go. There we go. Yes. Now go back to me. And this might be the time where... Yeah. The ghost ladies, guys. Who are you, another civil merchant like that coral slime up on the docking ring? This is my territory. I don't make deals, and I don't persuade easily, so go back topside. Mess with my profits, and I'll see you dead. Um... Yeah, I don't think uh, Chundar really cares. <laughs> like, they don't care about Chundar, I mean. Um, yeah. I mean, are you gonna stop me? I go wherever I want. Look, I don't care if you want to play tourist down here, but you behave yourself or we'll have a problem. I've got a job to do, and I won't be gentle with you, really understand? I mean... You're just a Zerka slaver, nothing special. I don't need this kind of garbage from you. Watch your mouth. I'm the only law there is down here. Something to say, get on with it. Otherwise, leave me the credits to earn. Yeah. I should just kill you. No one will ever know. I'm guessing it's these guys I gotta kill, right? Alright, I'm done talking with you. You've got under my skin one too many times. I'll bury you down here. Alright, here we go. Uh, Commander Dorn. Uh... Ooh, too close for the lightsaber thing. Should I go for the concussion first and then the? F Here we go, dark side. Nice, right, good job, Bastila. Nice. Yeah, that was worth the dark side, right? You know, that wasn't really that bad for dark side points, I would say. Nice. A sonic device. Okay. Just gonna collect the remains. And what about the guy that we just killed first? Uh, you can't loot him? I guess? No, it doesn't look like. Uh, <laughs> yeah, definitely. That's not that bad for dark side points, you know? We still get to play good guy in a way cuz yeah it seems like the Zerka guys they're not yeah they're not really good people okay and there we go all right so yeah we got it so what is this for I don't know terminate but Oh. Axis? Alter alternate? Okay. Well, I guess I can't really do anything about these things. So yeah, now what? Um... Yeah, are we done now? Oh. Uh, was that it? What is the thing called again? <laughs> oh no, I... Wait, is this quest not here? I actually don't even... I don't even know. <laughs> 
Well, you know what? Um, I think maybe we're done, but I want to keep on exploring. Let's go do another checkpoint. Watch out for that mine, guys. Oh my gosh. Okay, hold on. There seems to be so many of them. Let's also try to go and heal everyone up over here. Come on. Oh, is everyone yeah. full? Yeah, they are. Let's go and disable these mines. Okay. At least attacks are not loud anymore. What's going on over there? Over here. That guy's doing a flip. Sure. Okay. What's up with that guy over there? Um, hey there, buddy. Doing a flip. No, nothing? Okay. They're just moving along, I guess. Are we getting close to something at least? Okay, that's uh... That is something right there. <laughs> uh... Ooh. Okay, I think I... Yeah? You know what? In case this is the place, the wall that... Um, that Jolie was talking about. Um, let me get rid, rid of these mines. Yeah. I think maybe we can um, open up these mines. Or like this door with Jolie. Okay. Dude, I don't want to be here anymore. So many attacks. <laughs> so loud. I gotta run. Thing. I'm not even sure how to get a gland out of these guys. Get yeah, attack gland. Like for the brother? I don't see any dead, you know. Like I don't know if it's be if uh, we need to buy them from a merchant, maybe. I need to look back at that one merchant. Yeah, Eli. Yeah, be before we betray him, I feel like I don't know. Will we get locked out? <laughs> Before we betray him, let's see if he sells any attack lands. Um, yeah, maybe that'll be a thing that we have to do and all that. Okay, well, um, yeah, we are pretty much done here. But I think there's even more to go explore in this area, right? Yeah, there's like a whole area over here that we kind of stop looking at. Yeah, apparently there's like two ways. We can go there or over here. Well, you know what? Yeah, let's go talk to Jolie. Hey, man. I want to know more about you. Welcome back. I wonder, have you had much luck? Have you done as I asked? Um, yeah. Um. Yeah, I have made certain, certain approaches are gone. Yes, I heard the fuss of it. I told you I wanted a non-violent solution. Oh, my bad. I had my reasons for it. You should have thought about that. Circa Corporation will find the bodies and blame the Wookiees. This may cause more troops to be deployed. That means more disruption. I'm not pleased. But what's done is done. I'm not here to judge you. Hopefully you'll take care of that yourself. Um. Yeah. Um. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I couldn't find a peaceful solution. I regret that. Well, perhaps I have a duty to point out what you should have learned from this. Or perhaps no. Was that convincing? It's been a while since I've been in the company of someone that needed that kind of babysitting. Uh, will you help me find a star map now? Yes, of course. Let's get moving. I noticed the old path some time ago. You probably wouldn't have found them on your own. There's also a Circa Repulsor field blocking the way, past the poacher camp in the east. I saw it when it was installed, so I know how to pass it. And on the other side, ancient answers. And perhaps a Wookiee you were seeking. I hope he's in the mood for visitors. Okay. There we go. He's joining my party over here. Uh, let's go get a Bastila. Nice. Yeah, we got three Jedis, man. Ooh. Nice. Yep, this is the party that I want. Yeah, this is really cool. There we go. Yes? Yeah, three Jedi's here. Dude, look at our outfits. We even got the same outfit. <laughs> okay. Uh, well. Um. Yeah, let's keep on going. Wait. 
yet. Should we explore around here first? There's like this whole other area. There's a corpse over there. Like, why is this explorable? Okay, got some parts and more life thing. Yeah, can't wait to see more of uh, Jolie here in action. Okay. Can't do anything about that. So what, is this a dead end? Oh man. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, these tacks are all around us. Well, what's on the, the east side of this area? But yeah, I think I know what he's talking about with the wall. But yeah, it was literally like a wall was there. Oh, here we go. Let's go see Jolie in action. Oh, nice hit. There we go. Oh, they leveled up. Oh, shoot. He's going for the battle. <laughs> he's going in. He's going in. Uh, yeah, wait for me, Jolie. Dude, Jolie is so active. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, what am I doing? What am I doing? Dude, Jolie is so aggressive, man. He's going to aggro. Dude, you almost died, man. <laughs> you almost died. Uh, you don't care. What kind of Jedi abilities do you have? Oh, you also got cure. Oh my gosh, we got two healers. Sure. And you know, they can also do well in a fight too. Oh, that's amazing. I'll go collect that. Another corpse. Some more credits. Oh yeah, he can definitely, uh, take care of himself. <laughs> He almost went down though, but I mean, yeah, we saw him fight like four other Katarns, right? Like when we when we first met him. Can we not also like enter your house? The door is right there. No, we cannot. Okay. Well, nice place you got here. You know, I I never got to know what's inside it. And yeah, we'll be leaving this place as soon as we. Get what we want, you know, the star map, the the Wookiee. <laughs> oh man. Alright, so yeah, back on task over here. We're gonna be heading over to the purple wall. With my purple lightsabers. But yeah, Jolie. Yeah. Right now he's pretty cool. I like him. Here's the the sonic device. I'm not even sure what this is about. I'm not sure if this, like, scares the people out of the way, you know, to make it safe. Like, it might emit harmful sounds, maybe. I don't know, that's my guess. So, yeah. Uh... You know, I like how he told us that there was a wall, but he never told us, like, where it was, I think. Also, yeah, I didn't even hear, like, the whole peaceful solution thing. I just went... I just went crazy. <laughs> Well, here it is, man. Now what? Uh, okay. There, you see? Beautifully subtle, isn't it? At least compared to the other Zerka equipment dumped down here. It's only been here a short while, or the Wookiees would have disabled it. They wouldn't have had an easy time of it. Uh, why is this thing here? There are others, each blocking similar points on certain paths. It is all very calculated. Very precise. It would have been effective if it hadn't relied on the creatures to be walking. Climbers don't have much trouble getting around it. Uh, I trust you can get past it. You said so. I can manipulate it for a moment. Uh, let me see. How did the Zerg engineers do it? Ah, uh, here we go. Now, keep moving. These are the most dangerous depths of Kashyyyk. A few surprises wait for us, I'll wager. Oh. Well, we're past. <laughs> okay. Uh, checkpoint. 
We'll just keep on going. Oh, whoa. What's going on over there? Oh, Dark Jedi's? Hold on. What is this? What is this over here? Oh, yeah. Those are the Sith soldiers, right? Is that the Wookiee we're looking for? Oh, nice job. Oh, they're Mandalorians. Oh, they got some pretty cool armor. I even recognize them. <laughs> they look really cool. Let's go. Yeah, you know, just a bunch of Jedi's with different colored lightsabers and different type of weapons, you know, dual wielding, double bladed, and single bladed. <laughs> hey, can I. Great Baka! Uh, not me, but my friends can. Um, what happened here? <laughs> or, yeah, just what happened here? This is kind of mean. Um, I have the means to heal you. Here. Can you tell me about your attackers? Yeah, the Mandalorians are here too. Look into it. Yeah, he really wants him dead. Oh, really now? Well, that sucks. Do I really got to unequip? Light side! Oh, just when I got some dark side, I got some light side. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Only for the Wookiees though, I like, I like Wookiees. Mandalorian blaster. Man, I really want to be a Mandalorian in this game. But because it's called the Knights of the Old, Old Republic, I gotta be a knight. I gotta be a Jedi Knight. I'm not even a Jedi Knight, I'm a Jedi Padawan. <laughs> um, oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> I'm always gonna be there. Always gonna stay within that, that range. Okay. I mean, yeah, I know I can, like, you know, go back to my checkpoints and do, like, dark side stuff, but I don't want to do that to a Wookiee. I'd rather do it to like that gu that guy, like the the one the one that we just killed that he doesn't approve of. Yeah. Okay. Oh boy. Take that. <laughs> All right, one more. All of us, let's go. There we go, we got him. Oh, we got some more. Oh my gosh, and she's just charging in. She is just charging in. Nice, 
Oh, nice. Oh, the power attacks are pretty good. Wow. Yo, this guy. Oh my gosh. Is that the whirlwind? Yeah, is that the whirlwind? Oh my gosh. It just like stuns them. There's some... Hey, that's the father. He's got low health in a way. I don't know why. There we go. Heal me up. You cannot win. Dude, with these two, like... Yeah, with these two, like... Dude, we're like unstoppable in a way, because we got the healing and all that. But there's the father. Um, yeah, the father. Hey, man. Nope, I'm different. He's almost feral after all this time. Calm yourself, Freya. We are friends. Don't you remember me? Oh no. Well, this may prove difficult. Oh no. Do we really gotta kill him? Oh boy. <laughs> Wait, what is my journal entry here? Um... Not him. Uh, let's see. Really? They said F Freyr's the father, right? Oh, he'll have to subdue. Oh boy. Come on, guys. What's stopping you guys? Oh. I mean, yet. Yeah. Oh no. Oh no. Oh boy, I got two like light side type people. Hey, hold on. Freyr's the, the father, right? I kind of forgot, did. I mean, yeah, I'm not here to kill you. Just listen, please. Do you know Zalbar and Jundar? Yeah. Um. Yeah. Uh, my name is Fincer Ebenwolf. I came to Kashyyyk with Zalbar. Uh, no, he follows because of a life debt. Yeah, like, uh, yeah, why would, uh, Chandar want you dead now? now Ooh. um how I mean yeah everyone is on his side
Okay, that sounds reasonable, you know? I've seen stuff like this happen before. Baka. See this vibro blade. <laughs> um, I mean, sure. Where can I find it? someone or slay a beast oh describe the creature yeah where can I find this thing Try to find it. Can you give me any direction? Oh boy. I mean, what about the the Katarns? I'm sure he will forgive. I don't know, hopefully. <laughs> I mean, I'll make it so. Because, uh, yeah, I feel like I can control a lot of the uh, choices in this game. <laughs> well, okay. Um, I mean, I'll just do the Jedi mind trick on him. Maybe that'll work. I don't know. Alright then. Time to find this beast. He said south, but there's a viper. Oh boy, hold on. Let me save. I don't want to go through that whole conversation. <gasps> Wait, did I do it? Did I? Okay. I thought I accidentally load for some reason. <laughs> okay. Yeah, let me try this power attack. Is that actually good? Like, way better than what I usually do? The flurries? Oh, oh, no. oh wow. I mean, you know, it varies. It varies. But yeah, I just like doing all those, uh, you know, different slashes. There's the attack. Still don't even know how to get their glands. <laughs> oh, here's the ritual marker. Dangling vine. What? Why am I able to interact with this specific vine here? Uh, there's no indication. The ground is missing my blood. Uh, I guess I'll leave. Ritual marker. Uh, the beast comes and summon. If you are generous, it comes to battle. If you're worthy and wise, as you're lowry, for the same grave. Feed the beast, it will heed your call. Take vipers from their lair and hang them from above. Let their scent 
Uh. I see. We gotta, we gotta get those vipers and hang them on the vines. Is that it? Uh, we just killed one of them. <laughs> Wait, can I go back? Wait, where do you, where do we kill him? I killed one of the vipers. Oh, here it is. Yeah, we get the body. That was one. There's even more over there. The force fights with me. There we go. Yeah, we need to heal, guys. What can I do? Uh, whoops. Yeah, just keep on healing. I think that's actually good for now. Alright, so yeah, how many of these uh, bodies do we need to collect? I am not sure. Okay. So we got three of the bodies. <laughs> Should I go look for some more? This looks to be a dead end. But there is like another area there. I don't know, let's see if uh, three will suffice. I don't know, maybe there's like multiple vines there that I haven't seen. I've only seen like, yeah, one. Just one vine. <laughs> well, here we are. Yeah, how many vines? I mean, there's one. There's nothing else I can interact with. I guess there's only one vine. Okay. Uh, here we go, we tied it. What? Oh, movement is rustling off from a distance. Oh, snap! <laughs> well, here we go. <laughs> There's the beast. Oh boy, concussion maybe? Will that work? If not, we're just gonna go aggro. Oh boy. Yo guys, don't just stand there. Oh, he just did a di big hit on Jolie. And I'm poisoned. Examine the corpse, uh, you find a blade. Okay. Uh, also the painful appears the beast. Only cause oh, separate damage to it. Remove it, unless we want to free our spoke. Yeah, so I got the blade. There you go. Oh, marker? No. <laughs> so yeah, I believe that was it. Yeah. Dang it. Dude, I feel like I'm gonna get some light side points because I'm helping him out. But you know, I like the I like the Wookiees, man. They're just giant teddy bears you wanna hug. You know? Uh oh boy, where do I go? <laughs> I am kinda lost. I mean, there's also a path over here that we haven't explored yet. Maybe this will lead to the, uh, the friends of that one, um, it's about to call it Chewbacca, but yeah, the one Wookiee. Oh, there's a log. Oh, it's going over here. Okay. Dang, yeah, this place is pretty big and massive. Oh boy. Little cave over there. <laughs> Dang, yeah. I've explored quite a bit in this area that I think I want to save right there. Okay, whoa. There is a mine. What can I do? Oh boy, wait, hold on. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> I, uh... Dang, your cure is strong. Oh my gosh. What? Yeah, there is no, uh, thing. Uh, hi there, computer. Life forms detected. Determining parameters. Initiating neural recognition. 
Yes, there's the thing. Obstinate machine. I've no doubt it holds what you seek. But good luck getting it operational. Primary neural recognition complete. Preliminary match found. Match found? What the... It always muttered something about rejected patterns for me. <laughs> Begin socialized interface. Awaiting instruction. Greetings. This terminal has not been accessed for quite some time. Um... Why well, have you acknowledged me? Error. Subject displays unfamiliarity to environment. Behavioral reconfiguration will be needed before access. I am sorry. I did not mean to confuse you. I will answer questions to the best of my programming limitations. Um, I seek information about the star map. Accessing? Yes, I have found a star map in original system memory. Access is restricted. Um... What do I need to do to get access to the star map? Your request requires additional security access. You must be made to match the parameters I have been supplied. Um... Okay. And... Okay. How can I match them if I don't know what they are? There are measures available. Personality profiling will verify the basic structure of your conscious mind. With that, I will determine whether you are ready to receive the star map, or can be made ready. What do you mean by that? Information unavailable. If you have further questions, ask them now. Access will terminate with success or failure of evaluation. Oh man. You may begin the evaluation. Evaluation commencing. Result will be compared against the pattern in memory. Just act like you should. You travel with a Wookiee and have encountered complications. Hypothetical. You and this Zalbar are captured huh? and separated. If you both remain silent, one year in prison for each of you. However, call Zalbar a traitor, and he will serve five years, while you serve none. He is offered the same deal. But if you both accuse the other, you both serve two years. What do you do? What do you trust him to do? Wow, I've been asked a question like this before. Um, like it's, but you know, not not like in real life, like not in a real life situation, but like, you know, this this is one of those questions that you get like as I don't know what is it called this is a thing like an actual thing that people ask I think I don't know like I re I know this question like I know I, I read this somewhere I forgot what it was about though um I mean yeah I trust Zalbar I would say nothing and neither uh, would he are you sure if you turn you risk two years or none at all if you reply on loyalty, you risk one year or five. Your loyalty is dangerous. Your companion could take the opportunity to benefit by turning on you. Zalbar's family is mired in treachery. What loyalty do they know? Your what? answer is incorrect. Then I will change my answer. I guess. A superficial change will not match the pattern in memory. You must answer truthfully, knowing the consequences. I must demand honest acceptance of the proper behavior. That is a condition of my programming. Uh, continue with your evaluation then, I guess. The previous incorrect response will be discounted. Future incorrect responses will result in rejection. Oh. You are at war. Deciphering an intercepted code, you learn two things about your enemy. A single spot in their defense will be at its weakest in 10 days, and they will attack one of your cities in 5 days. What do you do with this information? What is the most efficient course of action? Uh, you repeat it again? I didn't really catch that. Hypothetical. You are at war. Deciphering an intercepted code, you learn two things about your enemy. A single spot in their defense will be at its weakest in ten days, and they will attack one of your cities in five days. Oh. What do you do with this information? What is the most efficient course of action? I'm not gonna lie, I feel like this guy wants me to be selfish, you know? So... I mean, yeah. <laughs> sure, I will, uh... Yeah, I prepare my forces to attack in 10 days. I do nothing in the city, maybe? You think? Or, this one will try to do both. Uh, but I feel like this guy wants me to, to answer badly, so... Or like, you know, in an evil way, so... Very good. If you had moved to evacuate the city, you would have alerted the enemy to their lost codes. Ultimate victory required the deaths of the people in that city. You wisely ignored sentiment in your decision. 
Uh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> I mean, yeah, the victory is irrelevant. Stopping the war saved many more people. You achieved the proper result with logic that does not match the pattern in memory. I shall adjust my evaluation. Hypothetical. Remove the ongoing war from the previous example. Consider enemy states to be weak and remote. With no external threat, your empire stagnates. Your people become complacent and begin to question you. Same scenario as before. You discover an impending attack, but also a weakness that will come after. How do you react? I'll repeat it again. <laughs> Hypothetical. Remove the ongoing war from the previous example. Okay. Consider enemy states to be weak and remote. With no external threat, your empire stagnates. Your people become complacent and begin to question you. Same scenario as before. You discover an impending attack, but also a weakness that will come after. How do you react? I mean... Ooh. I guess I do nothing so I can attack their weak spot later and... I don't know. Yeah. No. You cannot hide behind their greater morality. Oh no. This is a single attack. The enemy does not intend a sustained conflict. There is no war to end. You must choose the outcome based only on its immediate benefits and consequences. Um... Now let the attack happen. Of course you do. It makes the most strategic sense. Your people will rally beneath you against the common foe. As their eyes turn outward, your rule will strengthen. The trappings of war grant many opportunities. You have matched the pattern in memory. I recognize you and will fulfill my designated function. Uh... <laughs> yeah, why test me? Who have you done this for? That information is not available. Soon you will recognize the proper course to follow. The star map is yours. This unit has now completed its primary duty and has finished with the subject. Executing final action. Activation of star map commencing. Parameters reset. Stasis initiated. And communication. Well, okay. The star map. There it is. We got it. <laughs> Ooh. Well, first, yeah, we gotta wrap things up with Zalbar in his story. Oh my gosh! Wait, how does this work? What? I get dark side points and light side points. Well, well, a star map. An ancient artifact of dark side power. Can't say I'm surprised. I always knew there was something funny down here. I wonder if the star map has had an effect on the evolution of the creatures here in the Shadowlands. Might explain why it's so dangerous down here. An interesting theory. I suppose we don't have time to test it now, do we? Now that we've got what you came for, we should be heading back up to the treetops. Oh yeah, first uh, Zalbar. Don't forget about him, dude. <laughs> or you know, with the uh, Freyer and all that. Uh, wow. Wait, hold on. Where am I now? I just got light side and dark side. Oh, it's still the same. Okay. <laughs> it doesn't matter. I mean, I guess it's because of uh. The whole Zalbar thing. I'm guessing because of that I get the light side stuff. Oh man, yeah, I'm still pretty much like neutral. Oh! Mandalorians. I think I'll save this for next time, guys. Yeah. Next video we'll be wrapping things up with uh, Zalbar and also, uh, yeah, maybe that other Wookiee too. So yeah, guys, uh, that'll be for now. That's game.